Today, though, I'm going to touch briefly on the electric brakes that are mandatory for anything that's over 750 kilos. Start off with a, a brake controller that looks similar to this, that goes under the dashboard of the vehicle. And then we migrated into a little dial adjustment here with the guts of it being behind the dashboard. And today we're also going to touch a little bit on, on, on this particular unit, which is the electbrakes.com uh, variation. The reason why these particular style, or this style of product is not as popular these days is because knee airbags get in the way. And of course you can't have this under the dashboard with a knee airbag. So that's why people have migrated to this smaller installation on the dashboard with the dial arrangement. However, with the elect brakes uh, uh, control unit, this actually is a slightly different installation in the fact that it mounts on the drawbar of the caravan or the camper trailer. So what, what does that all mean? It means if you've got your caravan rented out on a website like Camplify.com, what does the hire have to do when they come pick up the caravan? So rather than go to the expense of actually putting a brake controller in a caravan that they might be renting just for two or three days, this particular unit can actually mount on the drawbar of the caravan or camper, either with four screws or with a cable tie. Then what happens is the caravan trailer plug goes into the back of the unit here, and this part goes into the back of the vehicle. You then actually turn on your lights to power up the unit, and then to actually adjust the unit itself, you can either download an app onto your mobile phone, or if you do, don't wish to touch your phone as you're driving along, we've also got an adjustable remote control here that you can actually put with a double-sided Velcro onto the dashboard. That way it's within arm's reach when you're driving along if you have to make an adjustment of your caravan brakes. So not only is it popular for people who are hiring out your caravan or camper trailer, it also means if you've got multiple family members towing the same unit. So mum and dad might buy a caravan, they might lend it out to their son, they might lend it out to their daughter as well. So rather than have three sets of electric brakes in three different cars, this particular unit mounts on the drawbar of the caravan, which is kind of handy, it's, it's portable. You might be getting a brand new car in 10 months time and you don't wish to pay electronic, uh, an automotive electrician to install a brake controller in the car, only then have to pay them to later on 10 months down the track when you get your new car to take it out and put in your new car. Also, some people with company vehicles, they're not allowed to put electric brakes in their vehicle. They might be allowed to tow a small 6x4 trailer down to the tip, but they're not allowed to tow a great big caravan. So this is a nice installation that's not permanent, that can go again go on the drawbar of the caravan or the camper trailer. So ideal for multiple family members towing the same van, or if you're getting a brand new car, or you've got a company car, or again if you're hiring it out on Camplify.com, which is like Airbnb for your RV.